Hi everybody, this is me, Hitman for President and welcome to my channel. In this video, I get to join a test ride organized by the TM Motor World and I get to test ride the Suzuki GSX-1000 GT. And for those of you who have followed me, you guys would probably know that I don't do touring and I don't like sports touring is never on my list of my next bike. But when I joined the test ride, I look at it like, hmm, it's kind of nice. So I decided to just go for it. So, so far my assumption about the bike is supposed to be heavy, it's supposed to be uh, like riding an elephant. But once I swing my leg over the bike and it's just stood upright immediately and then now both my feet are planted on the ground. So to me that is surprising. So, so far everything is looking good. Now, you gotta understand that this is my very first experience of riding a sports touring bike. So when I'm supposed to be moving the bike to the left side from a standstill, I was a bit nervous because I was thinking shit it's a heavy bike and I don't know if I can do this so I was kind of nervous at first but then when I just let go of the clutch just fought a little bit and then when the bike started moving it just went off it's very easy it started to feel very light which is very surprising when I go because when I check the uh, bike's back it's about 226 kilogram it's supposed to be a very heavy bike it's about 26 kilograms more than my old SV650 and now from the traffic light we are turning right and I was thinking okay I just need to get to know the bike for a little bit because I've never ridden a bike with a right by wire throttle and then everything has felt so easy with this bike look at it the sound is nice uh, the quick shifter although the quick shifter I had a bit of complaint it feels kind of heavy it doesn't feel that smooth but it's there uh, it, it works just fine it just feels like it could be more refined Now that we're heading back, the long stretch is a lot longer and the traffic light, there's only one traffic light so we don't really have to wait for too long so we, I took the chance to just rip it. But it's very unfortunate because the, the, there were just too many cars and I had to be mindful of the traffic so I couldn't really go over 200 km per hour. So 170, 180 km per hour, that will have to do. So my conclusion is if I want to go down the sports touring route, this is probably the bike that I'm going to go with. I've never ridden or ever sat on any of the other sports touring bike. The ones that I've seen and maybe I've sat on it once, it's the Kawasaki GTR, about 1400cc. Don't know if I'm right but yeah, I've sat on it once. Uh, I didn't really feel that it kind of suits my style and I don't like the bike that is, feels like I'm riding an elephant. So I can imagine that when I'm out on the road on a highway heading back to my hometown in Kedah which is about 500 kilometers away from KL from where I live, 
it's gonna be such a breeze on this bike so thank you guys for watching this video uh, it's a very short it's not really a review it's really my uh, experience sharing because I've never ridden a sports touring uh, bike before and the Suzuki GSX 1000 GT may change my mind about how uh, sports touring is supposed to be and the next video I am going to be doing an experience sharing video about the GS Suzuki GSX 8S so I'll catch you guys later and uh, goodbye